Dave, this is a wild story. Yeah, it really takes the whole political infighting statement to a different level. As you said, this video sending shockwaves throughout Michigan's political circles. And the woman we spoke with tonight, she says that she believes it was all a setup against her. Making the rounds online after being obtained and posted by Bridge Michigan shows a tense altercation between Kalamazoo County Republican Chair Kelly Sackett and Macomb County GOP Secretary Melissa Felis and reportedly follows a heated day at the party's first state committee meeting of the year in Clare recently. Oh, yeah. oh, my God. I felt like I had a target on my back. We talked with Sackett via Zoom. She was in my face with a cigarette, and I had warned her to get her cigarette out of my face, and she didn't. And it was extremely close to my face, and I felt like I was going to be burned. And quite honestly, um, the phone was in the hand with the cigarette, so that's why the phone went flying. But it was the cigarette that I hit because it was right over here by my face. We stopped by the home of the Macomb County GOP secretary for her side of the story. Do you know if she'd want to talk to us at all? No. Okay. We were told she was not there and that there would not be a comment. Former conservative attorney general nominee Matt DiPerno, who's also Sackett's lawyer, says the incident dates back to battles for how certain operations are controlled within the Kalamazoo County Republican Party and what party leaders in other areas of the state think of it. Within the Republican Party, there's been a lot of infighting that's created a lot of animosity and that has to end. Uh, and the KGOP, I think, is now on the forefront of, uh, uh, you know, not only building a coalition with other counties, but also uh, taking the bold steps of saying uh, mm -hmm. we have the ability and the authority to control our membership. If you don't follow our bylaws, if you disrespect other people, if you disenfranchise other delegates, um, you'll be removed from the executive committee. Meantime, no word on if the two sides in the altercation will make peace in favor of broader party unity. We're all losing right now. With all of this infighting, there is no winner. The Democrats are winning right now. And, and the longer that this continues, uh, the more we lose. And tonight I did speak with Christina Caramo, the GOP state party chair. She simply told me she has no comment on the matter. And again, we also reached out to the Macomb County official also in that video. We reached out to her via Facebook to try to get a comment. We haven't heard back just yet. Reporting live, Dave Kinchin, Fox 2 News. Yeah, Dave, you kind of zoom out and you realize the majority of Republicans in the state are not in these meetings. They're not necessarily involved in these types of things. They want to know how to come together. And at this point, that's a critical piece that needs to happen for this party in the state of Michigan. Yeah, and it's critical for fundraising. Every day is several dollars for any political party. Certainly getting ready for that election season, uh, that work never stops when it comes to state political organizing, and regardless of the party. So there's a lot of time that many members would rather focus on getting that message out ahead of the next election round.